Today we're going to do a uh, chair and lummy stick activity to the overall theme from Mario Brothers. Um, form is how the big sections are organized in music. The letters change because the music changes and we have a different activity for each section. Um, sometimes we're going to be tapping the beat, which always stays the same. Sometimes we're going to tap the rhythm, which is a combination of big and small beats. Um, you need a chair and some sticks to do this. If you don't have a chair, you can use a bucket. You can also do this all with body percussion as well. So um, do the best you can and we're gonna move on from there. So for the introduction, we're gonna tap the rhythm. I'm gonna try that one more time and you can go ahead and echo. Very nicely done. For the A section, we're gonna tap and click the beat. So tap is the back of your chair, click is your sticks together, just like this. So go ahead and try this with me. The B section is probably the hardest. We're gonna do a side, tap, click, tap, side, tap, click, tap, tap, tap. Let's give that a try together. Side, tap, click, tap, side, tap, click, tap, tap, tap. We'll do it one more time. Side, tap, click, And then we're going to do the side, tap, click, tap, click, tap, side. So let's try that together. Side, tap, click, tap, click, tap, side. So the entire B section pattern goes like this. We're going to give it a try together. It's kind of tricky to do it without the music, but we're going to do the best we can. Here we go. Side, tap. For the C section, very simple, tremolos. Try not to do it too hard, we don't want to break any chairs at home. And then for the D section, you're going to pop the rhythm. I have a little tube here which makes a neat little popping sound, sounds like Mario jumping. You may not be able to do that at home, you might have to clap it or something and that's okay. So we're going to do... And that's going to be tricky to do without the music, but we'll try it together. Here we go. All right, everybody, we're going to give this a try. <clears throat> There's no help at the beginning, so we might get in there a little late, but we're going to do the best we can. Just remember that the form is how the big sections are organized in music. The letters change because the music changes. We have B, which is always the same, and the rhythm combination of big and small beats and we're gonna go through this together. Alright everybody, great try. Um, 
I don't expect you to get that on the first try. So you might want to practice a little bit. And even if you never get it perfect, that's fine. As long as you understand that the, the sections in the music change, and that's our form, how the big sections are organized in music, and the letters change because the music changes. So have fun with this one, guys, and we'll see you later. Bye.